We all want to protect those we love. Keep them close, safe. It's when you only want to keep them that's trouble. We are meant to build bridges to one another. Instead, Theodore builds defense mechanisms. Many, many defense mechanisms. Imprisoning himself and everything he loves with him. He would do anything to protect his possessions from outsiders. Forgetting that it's what's inside that counts. Beyond that gate lies Theodore. Emphasis on the odor. He's the sole warden of this prison. Cause he was the sole person to want that job. <laughs> I was also the best candidate. I mean, look at my gate chains. It takes multiple cannon shots to destroy those. The scent of fresh cannon fire suggests he's being literal, yes? Correct. And be careful. He plays the fool. But he wants you to come in because no soul has ever gotten out. Everything he loves in chains, including the door to his lair. He's hidden the hooks that hold up his gate all around this prison. You'll need to break each one to reveal his door. If he ever gets out of this place, I'll tell you, he doesn't. I go out all the time! To cooler places than you've ever been! He's a prisoner too. He just can't see it from under his giant helmet. <laughs> Get out of here! 
shaking in his tiny boots. Could you stop? You're getting farther here than is convenient. I'm so thrilled I mustered up enough strength to make you a return portal. Enjoy. Who opened that return portal? Is it? Yeah! It's her, isn't it? You got some clothes on you! Oh, wait, yes. I'm starting to think you might... 